In our health news today, the Nairobi River has turned sewer conduit in Kenya's capital. Its waters turn from clear to black as it traverses informal settlements and industrial hubs. As clean water runs short, one of the Africa's fastest growing cities is struggling to balance the needs of creating jobs and protecting the environment, and the population of over 4 million feels the strain. According to Issa Musa, a resident of Dandora slums, polluting of the river problems start upstream, where informal settlements like Korogocho have directed some of their sewer lines into the river. The slum has more than 35,000 adults, according to the 2019 National Census. Most informal settlements, which house informal laborers and their families, are not connected to sewer lines and have open trenches where residents pour that water that flows into the river. The river and its tributaries pass through Chibera, known as Africa's largest slum, and dozens of factories that manufacture textiles, liquor, and building materials. All have been accused by environmentalists of discharging raw sewage and other pollutants into the waters. The Nemabos hopes the national government's program to build affordable housing will mean more people have good sanitation. Thank you.